guys and welcome to part two of expeditions we're going back to arizona and we're beginning a brand new expedition so this is called squatters right uh squatters rights uh, we would like you to visit one of the most remarkable places in this region unfortunately it is remarkable not for its beauty but on the contrary it is a crashed rusty plane that spoils the local view and may further scare off tourists we have to make the cost of its disposal so it needs to be carefully examined. Okay, I guess they want me to like value up how much it's going to cost to actually get rid of. So we need a scout vehicle, uh, a, a, a sort of logistics guy as well, specialist. Let's hope this goes well. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Uh, I am tempted. We have a few vehicles, but we have mo multiples of the same vehicle. It's not exactly the same. Um, I don't know what SE stands for. Maybe special edition, potentially. So do I need two Actions? Do I actually need that? I could sell it, right? I, I don't I don't need it. So we may do that in this episode. Uh, scout vehicle, where are you? Where's my little Don 71? Look at that. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Don't really need a metal detector, but <laughs> sure. Should we take any um, jack screw might be useful or an anchor? Maybe take an anchor and that's it. Yeah, I think that's a wise idea. An anchor and that's it. <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? Right, Connor, I would like to sign you up. So on the outpost, we have an extra 100 litres of fuel, plus 200 repair parts, binoculars, um, are slightly improved. Um, he will cost 500, but we need him. So this expedition would not be possible without this man. Right, let's exit the base. Let's get going. I'm so excited for this episode. Um, for some reason, I recorded the first episode like a week or so ago, and I've not had the time to play more. And I'm so pleased to be back. I'm so pleased. I really got into the first episode. Um, hopefully, this can turn into an absolutely incredible series. With your guys' support, we can do it. I believe. I'll make mistakes along the way, I'm sure of it. But... I'm sure you guys will call me out on the mistakes as well. Like, I probably don't need the metal detector on the roof. I could have taken it off, for example. All right, let's put the dual wheel drive on. Let's go! So ready. Oh, hello. Rivy. It is bumpy in here. If you get car sick, this game might not be for you. All right, so we're going to visit this viewpoint. Where the hell are we going? We've sort of done a similar route. Oh, we're going over there. Okay. Oh, from here, you could already see our goal. Look through the binoculars. Okay, we can do that. Ah. Whoop. Foot of the hill. There's a climb there. Oh, a climb. So they're sort of new for this game. It's sort of designated areas where you Gain a little bit of XP. And it's going to be rough. <gasps> it's the plane. I just realized there's, there's the plane. How did I not spot that? Oh, God. Yeah, that is that is hideous. Can we get rid of that? I mean, it's actually quite it's quite a cool like, landmark, really. It doesn't bother me. But, but I can understand for tourists. Might not be ideal. Alright. Uh, so, should we drop down here and then sort of take a right? I think that's a good idea. Try not go too quick. Ooh. Ooh. Carefully does it. There's no rush. Definitely one thing I I don't want to do with this series is rush. Just enjoy it. Just take your time. I say that. I'm sure that will change at some point. Try and go between the trees. Uh, right, this is where maybe might be a good idea to whip out the old drone. Can we go off there? It's not too high, is it? That's not too high. So we drop down there. It shouldn't be too bad. There's my car, looking absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, we should be alright. Just make sure that drop wasn't too big. Might take a little bit of damage. No, it's fine. 
Ooh, it's a cactus. Yes. So cool. I, I, I've heard they would like to add snow at some point. I'm sure there will be a snow region. I'm sure a lot of you guys are missing the snow. I'm pretty sure snow will be in this game at some point. I'm sure of it. Pretty clear route here. Again, this is definitely one of like the early expeditions. Um, they're going to get so much more difficult. I also don't know. Maybe you guys can leave a comment below. Should I just focus on this first territory, this first region, and just get all the expeditions done before we move on? Or would you guys be fine with switching regions? Oh, there we go. Looks like a place where we can go up to get a little bit closer to the plane. Yep, should be fine. Ooh. We made it! That was a bad two, actually. The Don 71 done a very good job. Right, scanning. Right, how can we get rid of that? Maybe that's going to be a future, a future expedition, potentially. Maybe. The survey is done. One second, is that someone living here? I did say squatters' rights. So maybe someone is living here. Yep. <laughs> but where does he get his food? That's a good point. Should we have a look? Where does he get his food? Drive up to the cliff. You don't mean to go off that, do you? Whoa. I want to explore the area, that's fine. We could whip out the drone for this. Beep. Beep. My expert drone skills. Might go fishing. Maybe. That's honestly the only area I can really think of. Would that have fish in there? I don't know if it would. Would that have fish in it? Maybe he shoots the birds? I don't know. <laughs> Who knows? All right, so we got to like 40% here. We might have to move a little bit. Look at my car. It looks so good. I love the decals on it. Beep. Oh, hello. What have we found over here? Some kind of cargo. Little airdrop. I'm really tempted. I don't know if I should do this or not. I'm tempted to use an anchor. And I will explain why. Right, here we go. <laughs> this could go wrong. <laughs> this could go wrong. Here we go. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that went well. Yeah, let's go. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. That's not good. <laughs> That's not good. Oh, no. Why did that happen for? Okay, we're fine. It's fine. Don't panic. Okay, let's maybe not use the anchor. <laughs> uh, it's not... It needs to be almost more like vertical. There's like too much stuff in the way. I will, we will come back and use the anchors again, I promise. That was um, a pretty epic fail, to be honest. Right, so we need to head more like over here. The drone doesn't quite reach. Is there a way to get down, though? So the anchor was a good idea, but maybe it wasn't the right location. Might as well get this airdrop while I'm here. What is it? Guess we'll find out. Um, it is... Oh, deck screw. That could be useful. Um, some scrap metal and... What? A part of a dinosaur skeleton? So I guess we could sell that. I'm full? Are you kidding me? Uh, do I leave the jack? I've got more anchors. I've got five anchors. Okay, so we can... I've only had one. Could try the anchor here. Whoa! I stopped! Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, God. 
Oh, wow. I thought I pushed the brake, but I guess it was still moving. That went bad, didn't it? I just got rid of my jack screws as well. The timing on that was um, impressive. Very impressive. There we go. Look at the anchor. Go! Pull! Yes! Right, how's the engine looking? <laughs> I put the handbrake on. I think it was just too late. It was just too late. Do we have any repair parts? We do. Okay, so the engine's still... It's fairly operational, he says. Are we within that circle? That sort of head... I honestly have no idea. Just wing it. Just enjoy the exploration. Man, those anchors are useful. Very, very useful. Uh, I do like the Don does like to um, roll over a little bit. Right, keep it going. Just trying to stay within the circle. I knew this would be an adventurous episode. <laughs> I was right. 92%. We're getting there. It's a pretty simple job, Scott. And I'm somehow screwing it up. Almost completely destroyed the car. Uh, we did it! Right, examine the traces of the wreckage. Okay. So we're heading back now. Fantastic. I was just there a second ago. Alright, we're going to head back now. I guess we head back the way we came. Saying that, we dropped off a cliff, didn't we? So, oh, I don't know. <laughs> that wasn't quite my plan. So it would have worked there if we had an anchor and we sort of dropped down. It does feel, make it feel a bit like almost like James Bondy, like Tom Cruise, Mission Impossible, which is kind of cool, but maybe not as realistic as maybe like a SnowRunner. But a nice low gear, yeah. Come on, that's not that bad, really. All right, let's try more speed then. It doesn't have a diff lock before you guys start screaming at me in the comments. Might need an anchor. Wow. Did not expect to need an anchor there. These things have saved me, honestly. Right, so put it right here. Winch up. Handbrake off. Let's go. Pull me up! Yes! Thank you, anchor. I might have been able to struggle up that, but while we have them available, um, does it does cost a bit of money to use them as well. So we don't get like a refund after the expedition, but... Yeah, it's fine. It's all good. Well, that was quite the adventure. <laughs> that was mad. That was mad. Uh, take less than 200 damage. Wow. Recognize at least three unknown points on the map. Damn it. That's, that's, that's a decent amount of money that I've missed there. So I think we discovered maybe one or two. Just that elusive... Uh, I should have looked at the optional objectives there. I do apologise. But we can sell the dinosaur bones for a little bit of extra money as well. So that's good. And yes, we did take some damage. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, funny. Funny, funny, funny. So that's only the second expedition out of 37. Out of 37. We've got a lot to do. So just unlock this. Fallen from heaven. Um, I'm guessing most of these... Yeah, these are all locked until we do an expedition which actually unlocks it. Which I guess makes sense. Right, Fallen from Heaven, what's this? We have lost one of our drones somewhere in the tourist area. Its flight record, record recorder may contain important information that should not fall into the wrong hands. Wow, okay. Investigate the suspect drone crash site and deliver the flight recorder. So we need an operator and we need a metal detector. I know the perfect vehicle for this. Yes. The one we just used. <laughs> so, yeah, the drone range has increased. That's actually quite useful. Um, the height of the drone can go slightly further. And marks airdrops with the binoculars. Interesting. Okay, you're pretty useful. You have been recruited. 600 for a day's work isn't bad, is it? I would take that. And then we're going to whip out the same vehicle, the Don 71. Um, are we able to do any further upgrades at the moment because we're using it quite a bit um, we can go for the 
the fine-tuned gearbox. A specialized gearbox with a manual mode for lower gears provides good off-road performance at the expense of strength and fuel efficiency. It hasn't really convinced me. I don't know. I'm not convinced. Uh, oh, we could go... This is probably where we should probably spend some money. So currently we have all-terrain. So obviously we could sell those. I think we need to up our game with the tires. So either off-road or mud. Mud are expensive. 12,000 for a mud tire. Oof. I think we've got to go for mud. I think we have to go for mud tires. Even though they are insanely expensive. Yep, we're doing it. 12,000. Ouchie. So I can sell my old tires. So they're gone. We could go for an extended winch. Yeah, go for that as well. Okay, you got some decent upgrades. I hope you're happy. External roll cage. I don't... It does... Mm, do I like it? Do I like it? Uh, I, don't, I don't know. I'm going to go for it anyway. <laughs> um... Right, do we have... We've got the slot already? Okay, that's fine. We've got stock bumper, roof. We've got a metal detector already, which we actually need for this mission, so that's good. How much do these cost? Oh, they're free. Okay, perfect. Um, I don't like the one we've got currently. Sort of matches the colour of the vehicle. Yeah. Right, again, what infantry do we want for this? Uh, anchors again? Yeah, I think anchors can be quite useful. The jack screw. Um, sure. Yeah, why not? Have we been to this part of the map before? I don't believe so. All right, so we need to get over to there. Let's do it. Let's go. I'm going to use these, use these new tires. Also got the the new cage as well. I know we're in. A proper professional outfit now. <laughs> Said no one ever. New objective discovered. Ooh. We'll do that at a later date. Particularly when we start an expedition, I'll make sure we do focus on trying to get the expeditions done. Obviously, if we find um, an airdrop and it's within the vicinity, of course I'm going to go and kill it, but... Actually saying that, should we do a quick little, little drone look? See if there's anything about... Little drone scout. Any points of interest? I really like this game. I don't know. Maybe it's just that initial sort of like couple of hours of the game just making me very excited, but I'm really enjoying it. I really like it. I know it's probably going to get a few... People are going to miss SnowRunner, for sure, but SnowRunner's not going anywhere. And there's still updating that game. They're still releasing season content. This is just something a little bit different. Also very familiar at the same time. I like it. Right. Descend to the top. Let's try and find this, uh, this poor drone that's been uh, smashed to pieces. Let's try and get down now. Uh, there is a steep descent ahead. Be careful. In such places, you should not rush too much. Yeah. Is, is that my issue? Probably. Maybe. I can see a slight avenue I'm going to take. But yeah, just sort of take your time. Maybe even drop it to a lower gear, which I am clearly not doing. Let's do that anyway, actually. Take this time. No, let's go let's go automatic. Just be careful though. Just don't use too much power. Just take your time. No one's watching ya. Ooh. Ooh. So we should get a Oh, what do we hear? Okay, sure. I don't quite know what we hit there. It was a bit of a rock, but. 
My poor engine. I can only apologise. Actually, do we need to... No, it's repaired. Okay, it's repaired itself. When the expedition's actually done. So with these new tyres, obviously they were a lot of money, but I would... I believe it's similar performance on the rocks, but conditions like this, where it starts to get a little bit more muddy, this is where the tyres come into their own. That's when they're, they're worth their weight in gold. They are beautiful tyres that we should respect and cherish. We made it! Right, explore the air. Oh, we're doing this again, are we? So we did the climb. Oh. Is that... Why is this something different? It's a random fallen truck. I did something different, right? No, it is the... I'm so confused. Fallen from heaven. Interesting. You've, you're already doing pretty well on climbs. But be careful. There's another one up ahead. Okay. Let's head up here anyway. Keep digging into that mud. Yes. Oh, over here. Sorry, I'm really sorry to this engine. It's taken an absolute beating so far. I think I need to get into this area and then explore. Okay. Not in the search radius just yet. Ouch. This car really low or something. Yes! That's me consciously trying to not take more damage. Easier said than done. Easier said than done. Right, we are now in the exploration area. Explore the area and see what you find. Right, I might send out my drone here to do some exploring. We have, if we have the device, it's good to use it. Trying to find some points of interest. Oh, look at that. I think we found what we're looking for. Oh, wow. That was a bit weird. <laughs> it was perfectly fine. And then when I got close up, it's like it didn't like me or something. Oh, one sec. Is that a bit of a plane there? I believe that is. Well, well, well. Definitely is a bit of a plane. 76%. Well, let's try and get a little bit closer. So we found some kind of like weird VW camper van thing and parts of a plane. Will the drone be in the plane or? I don't know. Let's stop here a second. Would advise, um, particularly if it's going to be like a very long, it's a bit ex long expedition, turn off the engine, of course, when you're doing this. But we should be okay. This is quite early on. Um, but it should be okay. So we need to go a bit more to like the outer circle. Which I can do here. Go my drone! Fly! Oh, one sec, we spotted something here? No, that's a, that's a rock. That's a very nice rock. Ninety-eight percent. Hey, scan the crash site for the drone. Okay, is that where it landed? Ooh. Start the scan. So we need to find points of interest. That that's definitely a point of interest. Oh. Beep 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 beep. Oh, one sec. 
Is that quite hard to control? Alright. I did see another part of the... Yeah. Please don't make me go to the top. <laughs> I don't know how to get there. So we'll find a room. We'll be fine. Alright. Last part of the aircraft. I don't know why the drone would be in the wing. Oh, it looks like there's another part of the crash drone nearby. We should ride a l around the area to look around. Okay. We need to explore some more. I mean, I'm, I'm fine doing that. Yeah, sure, let's do it. Reverse. The Dawn Sharing One, which I believe was in SnowRunner as well. Can I get through there? Let me try it. Oh, sorry, engine. I'm sure it's an easier route. We made it. Sorry, cactuses. Flight recorder. Find the flight recorder in the area. Oh, okay. It seems that a part we need is somewhere upstairs. What? So I just used the metal detector, apparently. So you want me to get to that location and then begin the scan? Or... There's definitely another part of the plane there. Just surprised I haven't spied before. Right, so go... Yeah, I think that's doable. <laughs> Famous last words. Yeah, I reckon get to there, and then hopefully that's where the flight recorder is. I'm pretty sure that's where we need to go. Wish me luck. What could go wrong? I forgot about the tyre pressures. Oh my god, what's wrong with me? How did I forget that? Uh, do we need to go... Yeah, go up here. Also, if we drop the pressures on the rocks, and we still have mud tyres as well, it's a pretty good combination. They were very expensive tyres, honestly. I spent a lot of money. See, stuff like that's my only negative so far. Like, textures like that. Now, what is that rock? It doesn't happen all the time. And again, I'm really enjoying the game. I don't want to like, be too like, negative. I do like to be as honest as humanly possible when I'm playing these games. Um, yeah, that rock textures. It's a small thing. The vehicle looks great. And most of the environment looks great. But there's definitely a few oddities here and there. Man, what a vehicle now with these wheels. It's changed it. Night and day. It's delivering. The only issue is, is the uh, is the driver. <laughs> it's true. The driver's terrible. Yay. Do we have the flight recorder? We have it. In our person. Deliver the flight recorder to the outpost. Okay. So what is that vehicle down there? Is there anything we can do with that? It does. Does it count as like an airdrop? That's a very good question. Um, are we able to like fast travel back, or do we have to journey back? I mean, I'm fine either way, but yes, I can recover, and it's for free. Sure. <laughs> Let's do that. Is that cheating? It does feel a bit like cheating. Uh, we can build these uh, modules. So these do cost quite a bit of money. So there's quite a benefit to, if we put one here, obviously that'd be extra fuel, spare tires. So if we're doing like a long exp long expedition, obviously we could stop off as we're going through. Because if we went back to the HQ, I believe the expedition ends. So yeah. This is done. We have the flight recorder. All is good. Done. Expedition complete. Oh, damn. Why don't... 
Okay. Recognize at least five unknown points on the map. Great. I think we discovered like two. Oops. I think so. Where does it where does it highlight the optional objectives? I need to get in. Okay. And I need to improve, Scott. We 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 delivered on the main expedition, but yeah. Okay. In the order to preserve. There is a unique building in this region. It was built a long time ago, and that's gradually falling apart. We want to preserve it as long as possible and make it a tourist attraction. Let's start by monitoring the weather in more detail so that we can have a rough... Well, we have time to react. Okay, makes sense. A portable meteor station. We need two of those as well. Two? What do we need two for? I don't know how these work. Um, this cargo, so you'll have to bear with me, but it does say we need a truck, off-road truck. So I'm guessing the Axion's probably the best bet here. Yeah, I think so. Um, I don't know if there's any upgrades we can do. So the Axion we have as well, not the SE version. Should we sell that? 83,000. Do I need that? Um... I don't know. Let me know in the comments. What should I do? I feel like I should get rid of it. But what do I know? Uh, we have a new front bumper available. So I've got a reinforced bumper, which does have a slot available. A sun visor, if you want that. Yeah, let's go for the big reinforced bumper. And then let's fill the slot with a spare wheel. <laughs> wow. Sure. That's different. Okay. And then we do want like an extended sun visor. We do. <laughs> Worth the money, okay? Worth every penny. Oh, we've got a roof rack. <gasps> oh my god. Four slots. Four slots. Are you kidding me? So, fuel. Fuel. Um, spare parts. Spare parts. I love the customization in this game. It's so good. It's so, so good. I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. So, cargo. We need two of these, right? That's what it said. What else do we take? We have enough fuel. We have a spare tire, so I don't really need that. Maybe some anchors. Maybe a jack screw, just in case. I think that's pretty, yeah, pretty much set to go. Um, oh, yeah. Can we look at the optional objectives? Here we go. This is what I want to see. So, take less than 50 damage from tire swap. What? Okay. Recognize at least one un unknown point on the map. We can do that. And take 100 damage. Less than 100 damage. We can do that. I think. <laughs> he says. Don't miss us words. Uh, we also need a mechanic. Mike, you're on board. Let's go. One thing I probably should have looked at is probably tires. <laughs> Whoops. Because this is definitely a truck we're going to be using at least at the start. Pretty considerable amount of time. Oh, yeah. Should we have a look at the... Let's have a look. See if we can find anything close by. Whoop. Anything useful. What's that? What is that? Objective discovered. There we go. Don't know what it is, but sure. Have a look around. So that's what we need to get to. Looks pretty achievable. What is that? There's the tower. That actually looks pretty cool. There's some really cool locations in this game. Some really cool locations. All right, come on, Action. Do your best. I think this was added to. I can't remember what season it was now. Season 7, Season 8. Something like that. Of SnowRunner. Oh, one sec. Oh, boy. We aren't going to go with that way, are we? Let's, let's go backwards. Come on. You can do it. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Beautifully done. And then let's uh, put the side pressure back up. Before we forget. Action! Yeah, so we're now in a different part of the map as well. 
Spappy is humongous. Actually, quite a good way of doing these expeditions. Um, fallen truck. Ooh. I'm not trying to do. Would you guys like me to do some more like random like side quest stuff? Like, do some exploration. Do some free roaming. Free roaming is still in the game. It's not probably as big as maybe it was in the um, in Snowrunner. But there's definitely still like tasks and stuff to do. Again, I might whip out the drone in a second. See what we can find. Right, we're heading up there. Ah, there's two separate locations that we want to install it on. Okay, we can do that. Send out the drone. Fly around to discover points of interest. I found a tree. Does that count? No. Nope. That looks actually quite high up. Is there a route for me to take here? Uh, how do we get up there? So I need to go... Okay, up there. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, that, that's actually not too bad. Look at that tower! over there why is there three distinct locations hmm interesting alright let's go thoroughly enjoying this game hope you guys are enjoying this game as well enjoying the videos again if you guys haven't liked the video please leave a like leave the support and let's turn this into an epic epic series similar to SnowRunner that was just uh, I did like 50 55 episodes on that game and the support for that game was just unreal. Absolutely unreal. Uh, I'm going to lessen the tire pressure. See if that helps. Look how flat they look. Come on. Okay, let's try locking the diff as well. Lock in the diff. Come on. Come on. Yes. Just finished the climb. Look at that gear we got on the roof. We sort of feel a bit more professional as well than maybe SnowRunner. I do anyway. <laughs> I'm sure you guys probably disagree. Right, this is the first location. Start the scan. It doesn't look in the best shape, does it? I'd, I'd be honest, the tower's gone. We ain't saving it. Despite the fact the tower is broken, really, I get, yeah, it is majestic, it is beautiful, but I just think it's not gonna, it's just not gonna last, is it? I'll be honest, I'm sorry. I can only apologize. I have to put one in over there as well. Oh wow, okay. We are going over there. So that was just a scam. Ooh, careful, 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 deliver, there we go, first one installed, so look it's mainly there due to the, the wind speed, I guess the wind probably gets pretty, pretty crazy, so we have to head over there now, oh boy, so head back the way we came, yeah, So head back down. We've got plenty of fuel and stuff on board. The truck hasn't really taken any damage. No reason to panic. Um, while I'm here, though, I'm just going to send out the drone. Is that a well? Well, well, well. Any things of interest?
Not that I can see. Get go off handbrake. There we go. There's something quite relaxing about these games as well. Well, I find them relaxing. Most games we play this day, these days are FPS games or Helldivers, which is pretty stressful. I've been playing that quite a bit recently. Right, if I can find the same route we came down... Was it, was it, was it back there? Like I've gone too far here. Is that the way we go? Yeah. See my my tire marks. Yeah, let's take it really easy. Really easy. A little too quick. Ooh. Get a bit too much speed there. It's all good. <laughs> I mean, we're still, we're still delivering cargo. There's a lot of people that are like, "Snow runners, snow runners for the win," and I get it. But we are still, we're still delivering. We are still delivering. I might have to use an anchor here, but I will drop the pressures. I will put it into a lovely low gear, diff lock, and let's give it a go. Oh, ho, ho, ho. you beauty. Look at the graphics on there. Mm. Beautiful. How close are we? Looks like we're getting quite close now. Uh, ooh. Shimmy between there. <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? Now, I do feel like that in this game there's more backup options. It's not completely like doom and gloom when you, uh, when you screw up. Famous last words. Look at that. What a truck. What a machine. Beautiful. I don't know if the expedition's going to be done up for this, so I'm just going to do another, another quick little route around. Anything could be interesting. I think we did find one objective. I don't know if that counts as doing the optional objective or not. There was only one as well. Would not fancy going through that. <laughs> that might be a challenge for another day. Gee, that would be tough. Really of interest. Go! Go, go, go! And deploy. Imagine if I forgot the second one. <laughs> Just stop crying. Yay! I didn't find the unknown point of interest. Damn it. I was looking. Oh, one sec. We've got a new gateway. Ooh. That might open up some uh, expedition potentials. I did try and find the point of interest. Did anyone spoil it? Let me know in the comments. And I will pin your pin your comment if I missed it. Perhaps I did. I was trying. <laughs> and failed miserably. So, what has opened up? Um, we have... What's that one near? The menu supply and up. There we go. So we've opened up a brand new region of the map. We need an operator again. A pre That's a big payment, isn't it? 20,000? Wow. Uh, hidden treasures of the Ford. Uh, that is not a vehicle, by the way. I did get a little bit confused. I knew the Ford was... Uh, it's like a sort of low-level... Like, on the river. Like a, a way to access the other side, basically. Um, I just got a bit excited. It was the first episode. I was like, oh, there's a fold in the game. Where's my full truck? I got a bit confused. Anyway, uh, we studied old maps and found a marked place not far from the fold. Who knows what might be stored there? Gold or perhaps priceless historical artifacts. We need to 
We need to find this place and explore it properly. Who knows what could still be there? Ooh, what could be there? Should we do this one? I, I was going to stop, but I still want to play more. Um, let's just do another one. So recover the truck less than three times. That's doable. Recognize at least five unknown points of interest. Damn it. Five. Seriously? Hmm. <sighs> And we get emergency reserve M if we do this as well. It's like a sort of a free upgrade. Okay, let's just try and work out these unknown. What counts as an unknown? What is it? Is it like a upgrade location? Let's have a look. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see how we go. Right. Do we need a truck for this? Watery terrain. Mm. What would it? A difficulty hard. Oh god. God. Seriously? That's not good. Right, so again, these are the tires we currently have. The sort of base all-terrain all, all terrain tires. Do we have the mud tires? Oh, I don't know what I did that for. Do we not have mud tires on Nox? God damn. <laughs> Why not? Uh, we could go for the off-road tires. So really good on the rock. Excellent off-road. These are average all around. I don't like average. Let's go for new tires. And let's sell these old ones. Uh, winch could go for an extended winch. Okay, but it's something they're going to keep using. I'll have a snorkel. Well, I can't have that, especially if we're going to be dealing with water. I see that's actually a really good purchase. And let's do an extended winch as well. Again, we can always sell it later on if we don't need it. Ah, so we have to try and get to this gateway. Okay, that's why I'm getting a little bit confused. Uh, we're at destination. Um, uh, should give me a rough idea of where to go. We're going the wrong way. Of course we are. I was a bit confused there. I was like, where are we going? <laughs> Hidden treasures of the fools. And I hope we find gold. How cool would that be? That'd be very, very cool. Can we get down there? Oh, gee. How do we get down here? This is where also the drone's pretty useful. So maybe go... Oh, hello. There we go. That's a point of interest, isn't it? It's got to be, surely. Airdrop. There we go. Be happy. So let's uh, loop around there. And then... That doesn't really go anywhere, does it? I'll loop around and then go down there. Okay. That's how we get down. So let's go and get this airdrop. I think this might be the toughest expedition. Easy for you to say. Uh, we've done so far. This could really go wrong. But what do I know? Ooh, eight thousand pounds for that. What? Eight thousand dollars? This area can be pretty rough. I can show you the ropes around here. Let's take a ride. Oh, that's actually really tempting. That is really tempting. But we're on an expedition right now, so we'll come back to that. Uh, airdrop. What is it? What have we got? So we've got some jack screws, lovely. We have some scrap metal. Actually, you have fuel. I didn't realize that. I can grab fuel as well. There we go. Tons of fuel and spare parts. Which we can now carry. Look at all this, look at all the stuff we've got. Nice. All right, let me head down here. We've got quite a long way to go yet. <laughs> this is fairly daunting, I won't lie. Uh, right, one sec. Do, 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 do. Don't rush it, Scott. It's all good. It's all good. Do we have to get down from here? Uh, I thought this was the right way, but it is the right way. Yeah, we can we can make that. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> they made the speed there. I'm not hanging around, am I? That's for sure. So that must be... The airdrop must be a point of interest, right? Has to be. Freaking hope so. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, God. Let me use this. I guess that, does that count as a fall? Probably not. Oh, what have I got to build a bridge here? Ooh. 
I know you can put bridges in. Maybe. Let's have a look. What does it say? Oh! It wants some spare parts. Sure. So you do make deliveries. Look! Oh, yes! Get in! Get in! Oh, that was awesome. Oh, wow. Look at the bridges! Oh, this is cool. That was lucky we just grabbed those spare parts a second ago. Oh, come on. So, so you can easily get up there. Look at this! Don't fall off. Don't fall off. Oh, this is so good. In my last episode. Where's the food? <laughs> Where's the food truck? Where's the Raptor? No. No, Scott. That works. Oh, my God! Wow. I do like to make my life hard, don't I? That was um, a fairly lucky escape. So, now that we've crossed the fold, um, <laughs> where do we go here from here? It has to be right, surely. It must be. It's not really like a direct route to get there. I'm very pleased we have plenty of fuel on board. Otherwise, well, I would be a little bit concerned. Oh, great. What the? Seriously? From what? Sorry. <laughs> Slightly frustrated there. Wow. <laughs> uh, where's some of you guys watch this and go, oh my god. Please, Scott, never go off road in the real world. Just don't do it. Save everyone. Just don't do it. I mean, dude, I, I drive a Nissan GTR, so that's my excuse. So far, so good. Ooh. Come on. Don't you dare. I sort of knew that was coming, to be honest. Righty. Um, tire pressures down. Low gear. Diff it. Go. Come on. Grab onto that rock. Did I have the handbrake on there? I think I did. At least I pressed the one button. Where do we go from here now? This place is... Murder. What the hell is going on? Oh, gee. Every time I get somewhere, I don't, I don't know where I'm going now. So we must have to do, 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 get down here, which I think is doable. I have to be careful, but... So you then go around here. Man, they are not making this easy for me, are they? Uh, I don't really know where that goes, honestly. Ooh, this is tricky. Ancient knowledge. At this point, I'm just trying to survive, really. More than worry about those uh, points of interest, to be honest. Ooh. I knew I should have stopped after that last one. <laughs> Why did I... A bit of more than I could chew. I knew I would. This may go horribly wrong. My tyres are still pretty low, yeah. That's why I'm going a bit slow. Wouldn't have been long then, so they started damaging. I'm also in a low gear as well, which I might have to go back down into, to be honest. Look at this. Wowzers. That was coming. Nice low gear. So it gets lots of like purchase on the rock, which can be really useful. Unless you're stuck like I am. Oh, that tire was permanently stuck there for a second. Come on. 
There we go. Yeah, well. And we do have those anchors if we need them. I was going to put down an anchor there, and I sort of stopped a second, but yeah, I will put one down. So one down over there. Push me out. Thank you, Mr. Anchor. Somehow I'm still stuck. Yeah, buddy. Come on, get going now. <laughs> we're, I thought we were making so, such a slow progress right now. It's mad. It's alright, just a slight scratch. I haven't even made it to the actual destination yet. Maybe that's like the main like tricky part really. Or hope so anyway. Righty. Um, I will do just a quick scan. Fly around to discover points of interest. We've got quite a long journey yet. <laughs> this is not close by any stretch. Not close by any stretch. Uh, right. In terms of route, I don't really know where we're going. I guess we go all the way down there and then some right. I guess that's a route. Um, <laughs> sure. Uh, i trying to look at the best route here. Is it a riot? Let's go to the riot. Ow. This is some tricky terrain. I was saying this game might be a bit more um, approachable for newcomers, but I mean, this is well, this is not easy. Okay, go all the way down here, and then we take like a sort of uh, sharp. Whoa! It's all good. Took no damage. You guys can't complain. I enjoy the challenges of this game, though. It's good. It's good fun. I like it. If we take damage here, I will be unhappy. There we go. This is exactly what it's all about. We can go down there. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> that's fair. Taking damage is just a part of the game, honestly. I am taking a bit more damage than I would like, but unless you want to go stupidly slow and stupidly careful um, which can be a little bit mundane oh, go down this way then Beautiful. Right, and now I think we have like a, a route to the gateway. Gateways were a massive part of um, of SnowRunner, and they are back in this game as well. Basically, opens up uh, different territories, different parts of the not say different parts of the map, but basically new maps, <laughs> really. So in like Arizona, there might be I don't know three separate maps or whatever. And we're about to discover as the first one. Go through the cactuses. That looks very, very wet. Um, hmm. Hmm. What's this? Hello. That might be worth going to. I am pretty. Oh, one second. Else over there as well. You see that? I wonder what that is. Could try and drive close to it. Also use the drone. Uh, 
this truck has done me very, very proud. Of it. I'm very proud of this truck today. It has done everything I've wanted from it and more. It has delivered when I have not delivered. And for that, I am very impressed. Um, we can take the... Do, 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 do. We can take the scrap metal and the bones. I might leave the jack screws here. I already have multiple sets. I think that's a good idea. I don't know. Um, <laughs> spare parts. I could take some more spare parts just in case. I'll take the spare parts. Yeah. Um, fuel... I think we're okay. I hope I don't come to regret that. But I think it's okay. So we're going to go back down. I sort of head towards that container thing. I don't quite know what it is, but... On the road again. Oh, we're on the road again. Um, how do we turn the lights on? I think I forgot to do that. Three point turn. But I'm back learning again. We're definitely making good progress now. I can sort of see why it was set to hard. <laughs> it's more like the distance you got to cover. I'm doing that distance without making any mistakes as well. One sec, is this something else? Is someone living here? Or what? Yeah, it's like a little camper van thing. Man, that is a place to stay and a half. Look at that. You okay? Yeah, they seem okay. Right, what exactly is this? Let's have a look. Oh, it's an upgrade. <gasps> it's an upgrade. I need to get that. I need to get that. Uh, I think we'll go that way. We need to grab that before we leave. One million percent. Imagine if I've gone the wrong way and I've mi completely misunderstood this mission, this expedition. I hope I haven't. That would be... Or maybe there's a gateway closer. <laughs> oh, don't. Just don't. Don't do that to me. I'm hoping... I think this looks like an upgrade. Come on! Please be an upgrade. Woohoo! What, what, what trucks is it for? Oh. My. God. That is a find. Yes. Get in. Action, you've now got a beautiful, beautiful gearbox. Oh, there's something else over there. It's a bunch of, like, airdrop things. Look. Loads of them. Oh, we can't go that way. Okay, sweet. I was about to give up on this route. This has been such a fun episode for me to record. I hope it's come across. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Um, yeah, please leave a like, guys. I would super appreciate it. I don't, I don't like to ask for likes too often and push it too much, but it just is so cool to see the series do well. Um, and I feel like the start is so crucial, those first few episodes. What is going on here? Is this, is this nothing important? Seriously? Apparently not, no? Oh, I just realized, I wonder if we have to fix the gateway. Oh, don't. It doesn't look like a gateway to me. Oh no. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Let's find out. What do I need? No, it works. Reserve places where the Arizona desert intersects with a lot of greenery. Very nice. Which, is, which distinguishes it, this area, from nearby territories. This is part of the Arizona region. Okay, so it's more like greenery. All right, sure. We've arrived! Yes! It's been a, this has been a really good expedition so far. What is all that stuff? Oh my god, it's like a little cowboy village. <gasps> cowboy town. 
Right, so we know where we're going now. So we was going the right way. Okay, that's, that's awesome. I was, well, I was a little bit concerned. It's still quite far away, though. What was that? A watchtower? What? It's like a classic snow on a watchtower. Oh, Jesus. Did not see that. Sorry, I was so distracted. Oops. <laughs> Oopsie doodles. That was probably the most clumsiest, clumsiest sort of mistake so far. I have to go have a quick look at this, right? Look where I am. What's all those, like, blue aluminous things? What's that about? Weird. I wonder if I can fix this. Whoa. Whoa. Maybe. I don't want to do this right now. Once here lay the path of miners who came to these lands during the, the gold rush. The historical community is interested in capturing this path in order to recreate the events of this beautiful area. Um, I'm not going to follow it right now. Actually, I did press A, but <laughs> follow the route. That'd be quite fun to do, though. That would be quite fun to do. Um, right, we're going to head for our chosen route, which is this way. I'm trying to work out roughly where we need to go here. Do I go right around this or left around it? It's starting to get a bit dark. It's starting to get very dark. It looked like an area that needed um, repairing. So I was wondering if it needed spare parts, but it didn't. Aha! The lights are on. Sweet. Uh, oh, boy. How deep is this? Looks pretty deep to me, doesn't it? Ooh. That is deep. <laughs> that is very deep. Don't know if we could maybe use an anchor around there. So, like, pull me across. Maybe. I'm trying to avoid the water altogether, because that water was too deep. Even though we do have a snorkel, I think we may struggle. Oh! Weird! From, like, further away, that looks harder than it. Okay, sure. And I see something over there. I wonder what it is. It's an airdrop. Could that be an airdrop? I've discovered an airdrop. What's inside it? Who knows? I'm going to lessen my side pressure because this is pretty uh, rocky. Ooh. Come on. I trust you. We've made it all the way here. Don't let me down now. I'm going a little bit too quick. I'm going to start damaging the tyres. Oh, boy. This is not done yet, is it? <laughs> this is not done yet. This is quite the crazy expedition, isn't it? This is where they really throw you in the deep end. Can I even get up there? I'm in the search area. Um, I don't know how to get... It's maybe a slight way to get up there. I don't know. We can have a look. Eleven percent. I can send up the drone, but I don't believe that's going to be enough to uh, explore this area. Oh, that was coming. Ah, there we go. Sweet. The map is still very useful. Uh, if you guys are scared of the dark, you can just skip time. Um, I don't mind doing that. I don't want to do it all the time. It's like me sort of... Um, how do I put it? Making my life easier than it needs to be. Try and enjoy the challenge. The 
is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, I'm on. Oh, that's pretty. Whoa. Just completely lost traction there. And we made it. With a little bit of help. To the top of the tree. And now we can send out the, uh, the drone as well. Again, was it completely necessary there to use the two anchors? Uh, I don't know. Probably not. What are we looking for? I must admit, it's a bit dark, to be honest. I think we have a light on the drone. It's a bad signal. Sixty-five percent. Scanning. Scanning. Keep scanning. Let's have a quick look at the map. What are we looking at? Ooh. A bridge. <gasps> That's quite tempting. That is very tempting. So we're we're here. Is it possible to get there? Is it possible to get there and potentially install another bridge? <sighs> Ooh. Who knows? Right, I'm gonna set can I set a waypoint so I can still tell where the drone needs to go? Let's have a look, see if that actually works. Um, it does work. Oh, nice. That is useful. I might, after we've sort of done this 100%, I might skip time here. I might go to that bridge. I am very, very tempted. And I believe that should be... That bridge looks terrifying, by the way. That should be 100%. Yep. So that is done. Uh, yeah, we're going to skip time now. Oh, that is beautiful. That is a slight to behold. I feel we can reach this. I've sort of done the tricky part already. So the fact I've used the anchors, I should finish the job. I should finish the bridge. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. All right. So I probably did those to um, go back down again. Um, might have to use another anchor here. Might get into position. Let's try. Let's try. Let's try about the anchors first. See if the Action can uh, impress me. Come on. Come on. Come on. Well, hey! Yeah, there we go. I thought there was no chance there. Should have had more faith. One sec, if I do the bridge, is that like a more of direct route to the objective? Oh my god, it is. Yes. It's probably going to be sketchy as hell. But we're going to do it anyway. Come on! Yes, right. Please tell me we have enough spare parts. Please. I did pick up some more. Yes. 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 Again, this bridge looks sketchy as hell. Completely sketchy. It's barely, like, hanging on. That is terrifying. That is terrifying. Oh, my God. No, let's not do that. Oh, sweet Lord. No, 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 stop, 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 That is, that looks sketchy as hell. That looks so sketchy. Oh my god. That looks really sketchy. Go, go. Why is it being so weird? There we go. And we're off. We are off. Man, that was scary. Righty. So, clear this. I'm trying to work out a route. Man, we've got quite a long way to go here. Ooh. This is not done yet. This is not done. Let's try and go to, like, like I don't know. 
here. So we'll see if there's like a route through. It would be kind of going to like fail now. I mean, we have a jack screw as well, which I believe we can use. Even if the engine's off, we should be able to use it. This cannot be the right way. There's no way. Well. That is a route down, apparently. Um, mm, I say that. Yeah, I think we can go down there. Just need to try and get up here. So, actually, fuel's looking a bit, a bit sketchy at the moment. That will do. Yep. Uh, it, it semi works. <laughs> it probably shouldn't work, but it does. And let's go down. Let's go. Right, where is this fold? I will find you. I will find you. Climb discovered? Oh, oh, oh. I have noticed there's a lot of... I don't know how to put it, but like really abrupt rocks in your way in this game. Like blocking your path. Definitely. I don't feel like there was this many of these sort of conditions in SnowRunner. I guess it really is like an expedition game, isn't it? It really is. That was good. That was good planning, though. That went pretty well. I managed to get through that. What's this? Uh, don't want to go to that. <laughs> don't know if I do. Um... Decisive, don't know what I might do. He's like reverse off here. Let's try this. Beep, 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 beep. Should be able to get back up there, I hope. Uh, around the water. Water is rare enough here. We love to get photos of it when we can. There's some actually fairly interesting tasks that I would definitely be up to for doing. For sure. Right, I'm starting to get a little bit concerned. Oh, hello. Wow. The timing on that was impressive. Very impressive. Um, I was about to complain about my lack of fuel, but we should. What I'm interested about the airdrops, do the airdrops replenish when I'm done, if that makes sense? I've got some more scrap metal here. Um, fuel. Put that straight in the car. So will that fuel now not be that? Do you know what I mean? That's, that is interesting. I don't know how quiet it works yet. I might end up regretting this, but we're doing it anyway. Can I take the scrap metal? Nope, I cannot. See, I think the airdrops, that's it. The fuel's done. That's that's what I believe anyway. we we'll have to experiment with that, won't we? Right, are we getting close here? <laughs> Please. Yep, yeah, we're getting pretty close. That's where that snorkel we got is going to be very useful. Ooh. Imagine if I fall over. Tire pressure's low. Is that enough for you? Oh. There we go. Right, let's try and get across. Woohoo! Should have maybe done like a little quick check there before I just dive into the water, but here we are.
Oh man, I'm loving this game so far. I absolutely love it. I absolutely love it. Right, so we could do, I guess... A, oh, one sec. Okay, that's what we're doing. There's my truck looking absolutely gorgeous. I'm, I've done, probably even, I probably didn't even need that fuel in the end. I probably could have just left it. Again, we may come back and we may end up regretting that. I hope not. Yeah, if anyone knows for a fact, I mean, the game's literally just come out, so I'd be surprised. But if the airdrops do kind of like, once it, are we going to, to the left here or to the right? This way. Getting close. Getting close. Getting close. There we go. That's what we're looking for. Yeah, do the airdrops. Um, once the expedition's done, do they replenish? Or is it like a fixed thing where you extract the airdrop, the fuel, the spare parts? Does that mean it's... We're still not done yet. <gasps> a golden nugget! Give me a golden nugget! Give me it. I want it. I <laughs> so desperately want to do that. Right, put the... I need to get one of, one of my jack saws, I guess. Exchange. There we go. We're still not done yet. Are you kidding me? We're still not done yet. You want me to keep going? You absolute cheek of a game. All right, fine. Let's keep going. Sort of thought maybe that would be it, but... I guess not. Now I'm getting stuck. Of course I am. Freaking rocks, honestly. Right, put the side pressure down. Put the diff on. Come on. Stop wasting my time. Right, now we've got to deliver this golden nugget. We better get some decent money for this. I'm pretty sure it did say... It did say 20,000. So, yeah. It did, didn't it? Okay, maybe I am pleased to pick up the fuel. Out with the drone. It's already getting late again. Ooh. Objective discovered. I don't know if that tower is relevant to anything. Looks like it's a bit on the uh, on the old school with. So. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not quite sure what to think about this. It looks easy at the moment. Well, easy-ish. As easy as the game can look. I don't know how we sort of turn right. I'm trying to find a route for that. Uh, at the moment, do not follow. Got enough issues on my hand. Thank you very much. How do we get up? Oh, shoot. Ooh, I saw that so late. Sorry. Sorry. I could try and use an anchor and try and like hoist myself up. So I think there's a little bit, there's a drop there. Okay, we should be all right. Let's go around this very rotten log and then go right. That works. Uh, should we go left or right here? Uh, that's pretty much the same wheel, isn't it? If I'm being completely honest. Yeah, about the same. And I cannot wait we do this oh i'm so happy quite the achievement very happy there's definitely more tasks than i thought there would be it was one of the sort of like criticisms of 
the game when it got announced, I think. I think people wanted like the random tasks and they definitely added a fair amount in, to be honest. One sec, what's that up there? Oh boy. Oh boy. That's another upgrade. Other, yes, an upgrade. Of course it is. Of course it is. How the hell do we get up there? Uh, uh, might be okay. What I'm going to do, if I'm. Actually, am I allowed to do this? I'm sure in the preview I was. I'm able to end the expedition, but continue, like, moving. So deliver. Yep. Does it just end? Um, I can continue. There we go. Continue. Yes. <laughs> Good stuff. How did I, I just forget? There we go. One sec, one sec, one sec. My lights were on. Okay. Try and squeeze between the trees. This is going to go bad, isn't it? That's it. Yeah, I could not turn down the chance to get this upgrade. I'm sorry. Just had to do it. I don't... We can't... We have to get to it, don't we? We do. Yeah, I think we do. I was thinking, oh, can we just use the drone to go and kill it? But that's not how it works. At least I don't think so, anyway. Alright, this is sketchy as hell. Yeah, I'm actually good, actually. It's fine, don't panic. This vehicle, though, has... Man, this is a long video. It's not bad to be this long. Um, Action, you have done incredibly well. You've impressed me so, so much. I'm very excited for the future. Very excited for the future. And we're going to finish it by getting an upgrade. What a way to finish the episode. Beautiful. What do we get? What does it work on? Oh, yeah, we go. I actually have no idea what that does. Is it? A, it's a wheel, isn't it? It's a wheel. Yeah, it's definitely a wheel. So it's a all-terrain tire, maybe. I think maybe. Good find though. And then we're going to press the old start button, and we're going to return to HQ. Get in. Get in. So we do have a couple of options here. Got breaking Brad, <laughs> sure. And we've got urgent repairs. So we've got a couple of options there. Thank guys for watching this episode. Had a lot of fun. Um, very, very happy with how it turned out. And um, I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.